Hey guys, so this is going to be my review on the e.l.f. concealer that looks like this. It kind of looks like lipstick, like with the way it's all set up. Um, and excuse like my poofy hair. I'm like in the process of getting ready, like I have my makeup done. And I just need to do my hair because like letting it air dry. And so I just wanted to do a quick review on the e.l.f. concealer. This is in the color Honey. Um, and that's like my shade there. And I got this on eyeslipsface.com, which is like the e.l.f. website. Um, the price of this I think is like $3. I'll put the link for it in the bottom bar. It's done very smoothly. And like, it blends in very easily. The only thing I would have to say as of now I don't like about it is the packaging because it is very flimsy. Like, I feel like if I have it in my purse, it's going to open. So I... I don't know like for packaging like or for traveling I mean like the way you're gonna like travel with it I would maybe put it in a ziplock and then like you know by itself because I do feel like it's gonna open and then you're just gonna ruin your concealer so I am gonna do a demo on this so you guys can see like you know what it looks like and what the difference is um, I would definitely say that it's um light coverage it's not like like full coverage or heavy coverage for concealer but you can see it blends away like very easily and it's not um, like heavy duty like you could still kind of see so what I've been doing since I've been using this is I've been applying my Scarnier um, Skin Renew Anti-Dark Circle Roller, which is like a really, um, like light concealer. Um, it's kind of like liquidy and it's just supposed to like help your dark circles and stuff like that. Um, so that's what I've been putting on before I put on the e.l.f. concealer and that's been my, like, under eye circle combination because and I mean you can definitely use this for like spot concealing like if you have any like blemishes or any like spots that you need to conceal um, but like I used to I don't want to say used to because I still have dark circles but like my dark circles for some reason I feel like they were worse than what they are now um, and I've been using that Garnier roll-on so I think it's helped because it's supposed to like help um, correct your under eye circles and I think it's helped because I can even like with the coverage I have now like I'm okay with I'm like whatever like I don't even like pay no mind to it really I just put the concealer on and go and I used to be like oh I hate my dark circles I want to want them there and I used to just pack everything on to make them look um, or to make them like go away um, so yeah I mean this concealer is definitely light coverage um, the packaging is kind of flimsy, but as far as the product goes, I mean, I think it's totally worth $3. If you are somebody that doesn't really need, like, um, to cover something like dark circles, or, you know, if you just have a couple blemishes here and there, then I would definitely recommend this because it's totally worth the price. Um, I'm actually going to recommend a concealer to my mom because she doesn't have um, concealer. She's never used concealer, and she needs some because she's, like... Um, has like under eye circles. That's pretty much all I have to say about this concealer. Um, I guess if you guys have any questions or anything else you want to let... What? If you guys have any other questions or if you've used this concealer and you love it or you know you use it another way then just let me know. Um, and yeah that's pretty much it. This was just quick, short, to the point. I hope you guys... I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you for watching. Bye.